Merci. Bonjour, général Clément Gagnès du magazine Express. Quand vous parlez des drogues... Hein... Alors, c'était euh, la... aux alentours de la, la mer Noire et vis-à-vis -vis de... Enfin, vis -vis de cet avion français. Oui, c'était euh, un échange radio euh, particulièrement, euh, particulièrement agressif. Oui, c'est une première. Euh, ce qu'il y a en revanche, c'est que euh, dans d'autres euh, pays ou zones euh, du monde, il y a des euh, interactions euh, avec euh, des avions russes. Nous avions déjà euh, communiqué. A, an interaction, uh, um, a radio interaction, mid-November uh, over the Black Sea in international airspace, international uh, waters, uh, of course, between a French um, AWACS, which was uh, on a um, situation awareness uh, mission and abiding perfectly by the international law, and a, a Russian uh, threat, uh, radio threat. The message was a uh, threat, a potential destruction threat, it, it was. It was the first time on the Ukraine situation, the, but uh, the French plane, or they arrived before that? So uh, with uh, the, this AWACS, uh, yes, it was uh, first time, but uh, what I'd like to mention is that uh, interactions and uh, unfriendly interactions with uh, Russian military happen uh, on a regular basis in different domains. Uh, it can be on, uh, in the air, it can be in the sea, it can be in uh, non-material domains uh, as well, such as uh, cyber, as uh, the uh, president uh, mentioned.